Could you go check for me? Hey, Ji Xian. Where have you been? I've been looking everywhere for you. I is that so? I didn't know. Sorry. Let's get going. He's too busy chasing after so young. Come on. What are you doing? Uh, wouldn't it be smarter to stay together? Don't you get it? He doesn't care at all about us. Even if you're in the same class as him, can he be trusted? Well, he probably doesn't know his way around here yet. So what? We don't know him at all. <gasps> Look at this. Fine. Do what you want. It's easier for me if I don't have to babysit anybody. You. I'll be watching you. Be careful.
What's the matter?
room I was talking about earlier. I've always found that kiln eerie. It's like a crematorium with burning corpses, right? That room's locked.
Ignoring me again. If you're still chasing after her, you need to snap out of it. Really? Just a coincidence, huh? She runs around like she's possessed or something. This whole school feels like it's been possessed or haunted or something. Ugh. Very nice. Worrying about the unfinished business of spirits. There's a complaint box sitting in the new building reading room for students to voice their concerns and complaints. But I doubt any student ever solved anything by using it. And I'll bet all the teachers forgot that it was even there. The living all suffer. But don't you think the dead suffer more? Why does no one listen to the things I say? Wait a minute. Where is Ji Hyun? Wasn't she with you before? Come on! Why did you let her run off alone like that? You had better hope that nothing happens to Ji Hyun. I bet this whole thing is about so young. That's why you don't even have a girlfriend. Why? Why are you looking at me like that? Got something to say? <sighs> I 
Look, I'm sorry. It's not your fault. I was just scared and frustrated myself. She probably went to the new building. I'm gonna go look for her. Catch you later. Thank you. 